It's the media launch for Techno Phantom 8 right here in Lagos, Nigeria, and I'm your very own sensational C Classic. Capture your legend. Can you tell me more about this Phantom 8? Because I saw Magic. I'm calling it Magic today. Can you tell me more about the phone? Exactly how I feel about it when the product first got to our office. It's simply magical. Two camera in one. Now, two camera in one, I thought it's not possible. What's all this? Perhaps I, I felt it was just some gimmick or some language just for marketing to just bobo the people. Yeah. But I was sold on it myself. Why? Because I saw that the dual camera has the ability to take a picture as if you're using a professional camera. So there's this thing we call the refocus feature. First, before you can do the refocus feature with the dual camera that is 12 MP and 13 MP, you're going to shoot a picture and it's going to give a blur effect that the professional photographers call the bouquet. It simply blurs the person at the back and makes the person in front very clear. That's the first attempt. Now, once you've taken the picture, you can go back to the image and decide to change the object of your focus. I must say, for me, in the last few years working at Techno, um, I expected by now I shouldn't be wild anymore. Now, Techno is established, was established in 2006. What has been some of our milestones? Um, first factory in 2007. In 2011, we pioneered the dual SIM phone, and Techno became known as the king of dual SIM phones. Everybody who don't want to carry a lot of phones, they want to go with Techno. Then in 2012, we decided to beat ourselves and we left feature phone, not like leaving it completely, but we also ventured into the smartphone world in 2012. Why this partnership with Techno? Um, there is a history. Slot and Techno share similar history. Um, Namdi Izigbo, the MD of Slot, we all know, have designed um, the dual SIM Techno phone, you know, and that was brilliant. Um, we, we know just developed in Hong Kong, produced in Hong Kong, but grew in Nigeria and from Nigeria expanded into the world. Yeah, everywhere, even in Colombia, they sell techno. So there's this history, you can remove techno from slots or from Inam de Ezigbo. Um, so that's the rich history. At techno, we have focus in our products. We have specific products for specific people. We don't just produce products uh, line just like that, so we have the Phantom, which is a flagship camera phone. We have the Canon, which is the best selfie camera in the world. I'm proud to say that. And then we have the large battery capacity, the L series. And then we have the new Spark series. We have Mr. Atayo Guche for Techno. How you doing, sir? Well, I'm great. Everything's fine. Very well. So how is it here? Oh, it's amazing. Um, you see the Techno Phantom is an amazing phone, beautiful, big memory, fast, sleek and fashionable. You see everybody's happy. People don't believe Techno will come up with something like that. True. But being who we are here, yeah, this, this is a product. Yeah, then we had, we had questions about countries you've, you've been able to reach. Can you tell us more about it? You've, you've got to different continents right now. I mean, let me say, Techno is no more an African brand. It's a global brand. It's everywhere. It's international. At the launch in Dubai um, a few days ago, uh, there are a lot of people that came from all over the world. And some of my colleagues only see their emails, um, get to see some of them for the first time. I'm like, okay, this is really a global brand. I mean, so that's it. Yeah. We need to do better. We need to beat our own record. So what did we do? So we assembled 1,000 plus engineers. For the past 15 months, with 50 partners to bring to you the new Techno Phantom 8. 1,000 plus engineers, 50 global partners, 15 months. Even women carry baby for less than 15 months. So if we carry the idea the development of this product for 15 months, that's what gave birth to this beautiful device. What's our vision in the next 10 years? In the next 10 years, Techno is going to be the most influential and favorable communication devices 
by delivering different experiences to consumers. I don't think anybody will want to throw his phone in water or something happen with kids, you know. So I think we are more careful with our phones now. Yeah, but being water resistant, if you put so much on a phone, then it will be out of reach that people can afford it. And maybe some of those things are not actually, it doesn't really matter as long as you take care of your phone. I think we should be particular about the screen, like the screen and then the durability of the phone and then the power. Number one thing in Nigeria is even power. Yes, even as adults, our phone will fall into water, but it's not all the time. If you want to go beyond that to make it a water-resistant device, then it will be out of reach of many people. And that's not in our DNA in techno mobile. What I have to say is that don't stop buying techno phones and your criticisms, your feedback, whatever you have about the product, uh, don't hide it. Log on to BBS dot techno mobile.com that bbs dot techno mobile.com is our forum for our fans log in there join the community share what's your concern your fears your worry what you like about the product that's how you're going to help us get better and better seeing is believing you've seen it you can have it so go get one so you can capture your legend be legendary thank you so much i'm your very own sensational c classic it has been the media launch for Techno Phantom 8. Have a great time.